Welcome to Keep the Faith Ministry News. I'm Hal Mayer. The recent deal with Iran on nuclear arms and six Western nations, led by the U.S., will increase tension and conflicts in the Middle East, not lessen them. And Turkey may stand to gain the most. Turkey is the largest economy in the Middle East and is strategically situated at the confluence of the Black Sea and the Mediterranean. From 330 A.D. for more than 1,500 years, Turkey has been the center of powerful empires. Though Turkey has some converging interests with Iran, including its dependence on Iranian oil and control and or manipulation of the Kurds, they are rivals for power. They both use the Kurds to undermine the other. Both want dominance over the Arab region, and most Arabs want neither of them to rule them. The Islamic State provides Turkey with a number of problems. For one, the Kurds seem to be the most effective force fighting the Islamic State. And while the IS has emerged within Turkey itself, including operative cells and other activities. In addition, Turkey doesn't look kindly toward Iranian expansion in the Levant, which is, it sees as its own sphere of influence. Syria is another challenge. Turkey wants to get rid of the Assad government and has supplied and trained militants to fight Damascus. Meanwhile, Saudi Arabia is alarmed by the potential expansion of Iranian influence in the region, and Iran is predominantly Shiite. And with Iraq no longer a bulwark against Iran's ambitions, the House of Saud is concerned that Iranian Shiites will stir up the large Shiite population living near its own massive oil fields. If Assad falls, it would deal a crippling blow to the Iranian influence in the region. So it's important to Saudi Arabia to support Sunni militants in Syria and provide them with arms to fight Assad. The U.S. attempt, along with five other powers, to rehabilitate Iran's international image coupled with Tehran's desires to expand its domain will lead to more conflict. The Iranian deal with Western powers means more war, not less, due to the complex and contradictory circumstances and interests in the region. Turkey, because of its geographical position, its economic strength, and its military interests, ultimately places it in the fulcrum of Middle East power struggles as it deals with competitive interests with Iran, Saudi Arabia, and even Egypt. Turkey has also played an important part of fulfilling prophecy. In 1838, Millerite Josiah Litch calculated from Revelation 9 that on August 11, 1840, the Ottoman Empire would come to an end. The exact fulfillment of this prophecy gave substantial influence to William Miller and the Advent Movement. Now Turkey is again growing into a regional power. Pay attention as prophecy unfolds in amazing detail. And he will be a wild man. His hand will be against every man, and every man's hand against him. And he shall dwell in the presence of his brethren. Genesis 16, verse 12. This is Keep the Faith Ministry News. Thank you for watching. Thank you.